This is what happens when a narcissist's love turns toxic. Welcome and thank you for tuning in. Today, I'd like to discuss why a narcissist might lash out at you even though they claim to love you. To answer your question, it's important to understand that a narcissist does care about you, but only because you are their possession and they rely on you for their own benefit. Narcissists view others as extensions of themselves and are not interested in a romantic relationship with you because they genuinely care about you. Instead, you play a significant role in their plans, but anyone else could easily replace you. It's not your connection that matters to them, but rather the purpose you serve and how you make the narcissist feel better about themselves through your actions. If you're not contributing anything to their goals, they will see you as worthless and discard you. Understanding this can help you better comprehend narcissists' motives and recognize when they are attempting to deceive you with their words or actions. Even if they seem charming and irresistible, they are likely trying to manipulate you for their own benefit. It's important to remember that narcissists are inherently conflicted when it comes to relationships and people because they both despise and need us at the same time. Let's discuss the three most important things to a narcissist. They believe they cannot succeed in life without these things. Narcissists are known for being self-absorbed and superficial, so it's not surprising that the things they covet are predictable. Their actions and behaviors reveal their egocentric insecurities and hollowness. Number 1. As we know, to a narcissist, their reputation is paramount. Narcissists put great importance on their outer appearance, from the way they dress to their demeanor. They place a high value on their physical attractiveness and how others perceive them, unlike sociopaths who may not care about their appearance or what others think. Narcissists, particularly when they were younger and more productive, were obsessed with their physical attractiveness and amassing wealth. Covert narcissists are especially strategic about how they present themselves to the world, often creating a facade that is vastly different from reality. They believe that it is a performance, and they must maintain the overall impression throughout the day. In their pursuit of enhancing their own attractiveness and shaping the favorable opinions of others, narcissists invest a significant amount of time, energy, and resources. They are solely focused on raising their own profile and prestige. Only those closest to them, such as their spouses and children, may be aware of the truth behind the mask. However, their greatest fear is being exposed as fake by those around them, which would result in them being labeled as evil monsters. Since narcissists constantly seek approval from others, they would be unable to cope if this scenario were to persist. Without the approval of others, their inflated egos and false sense of worth would crumble. Number 2. Narcissists tend to crave narcissistic supply which is the constant need to boost their inflated sense of self-importance resulting from the false image they've created. Narcissists only experience happiness when they receive attention, flattery, and praise from others. They crave the egotistical and dark supply that comes from hurting and betraying those they pretend to love. This essential aspect of their personality must be satisfied, which is why they deceive people into thinking they want a genuine connection. Narcissists place extreme importance on this matter and will go to great lengths to obtain their narcissistic supply. Since they see others as obstacles rather than valued resources, they cannot experience empathy or genuine concern for anyone's well-being. As long as we continue to provide them with the attention and admiration they crave, they will remain content. Narcissists exude an air of authority and superiority, as if they are above others. Narcissists learn how to manipulate from a young age. Without someone who accepts them for who they are, they do not value their lives. This is why they need to diversify their supply chain. They cannot be satisfied with just one person to adore them. They need to have multiple victims to abuse and exploit. Just like predators, narcissists are always on the lookout for their next easy meal. They cannot be happy with anything or anyone. They must have a backup supply in case their current stock runs out. Even if they grow tired of you, stop finding value in you, and put you on the back burner, they will keep you around while they hunt for a replacement. Narcissists view their victims as their property and believe they have every right to keep them around until they can be useful again. Therefore, it's safe to say that narcissists require a steady stream of their own kind of attention. Number 3. 
What matters to narcissists is their success in amassing wealth and power. They believe that their wealth allows them to enhance their false persona and distract themselves from their miserable lives, giving them some measure of happiness. They believe that material wealth can buy happiness and will exert themselves vigorously to succeed, even if it means using others. They understand that financial power enables them to control more people and maintain relationships with specific individuals. Narcissists can never have enough money and are never satisfied with what they have. They enjoy dictating other people's lives and instilling fear in those who don't think like them due to their wealth and power. Narcissists are convinced that they can do whatever they want if they have enough resources and authority. They believe they are above the law and demand front row seats in everything. Their ultimate goal is to become wealthy and powerful enough to dominate their entire environment. Narcissists are emotionally fragile and heavily rely on others to make them feel better or distract them from their inner turmoil. As long as they can satisfy their narcissistic needs, narcissists will continue to live. They can use their resources to gain more control, protect their image, and acquire more sources of narcissistic supply. Narcissists have specific interests and will go to great lengths to cultivate or acquire them, but they don't care about other people. I hope you found this video helpful. Thank you for your attention and consideration. If you have any thoughts on the topic, please share them in the comment section below. I appreciate it. Thank you. So, before we end today's video, let's summarize a little. Can love turn toxic? This is a question that has been debated throughout the ages. However, the answer is a resounding yes, especially when dealing with narcissists. If you are in a relationship with a narcissist, it's crucial to understand that their love is based on their need for control, power, and narcissistic supply. They feel you as an extension of themselves and don't care about you as a person. Instead, you play a significant role in their plans but anyone else could easily replace you. Understanding this can help you better comprehend their motives and recognize when they are attempting to deceive you with their words or actions. So what are the three most important things to a narcissist? Firstly, their reputation is paramount. Secondly, they tend to crave narcissistic supply, which is the constant need to boost their inflated sense of self-importance resulting from the false image they have created. And thirdly, finally, what matters to narcissists most is, is their success in amassing wealth and power. Narcissists place great importance on their outer appearance and invest a significant amount of time, energy, and resources to maintain their facade. They fear being exposed as fake by those around them, which would result in them being labeled as evil monsters. Since they constantly seek approval from others, they would be unable to cope if this scenario were to persist. Without the approval of others, their inflated egos and false sense of worth would crumble. Narcissists only experience happiness when they receive attention, flattery, and praise from others. They crave the egotistical and drug supply that comes from hurting and betraying those they pretend to love. They cannot experience empathy or genuine concern for anyone's well-being. They need to have multiple victims to abuse and exploit. Narcissists view their victims as their property and believe they have every right to keep them around until they can be useful again. Well, I think that's it for today's video guys. I hope this video is informative for you and if you have anything to say, please don't hesitate to write them down in the comment section below. Thank you for watching this and have a nice day.